Hey there, happy beings! Today we're gonna do something a little bit different. I have gone ahead and bought myself the Akaya Lunar Scale. Uh, I have been hesitating for months and I finally decided to pull the trigger. So today we're gonna do an unboxing and I'm just gonna share my first impressions. This is not a review. That'll come later when I've used it for a while. Let's go! If you're wondering why it says rush outside, that's a long story that we're gonna leave for another time. As you can see, I'm really struggling to open this box. Maybe I was way too excited. Maybe there's a lot of tape. I don't know, let's move on. I really like that the box was snuggled in there real good. So I know there's no chance of it moving around or getting damaged during shipping, which honestly is a great first impression. The box definitely feels nice when you hold it. It has a good weight to it. And I can't wait to open it. I feel like a kid on Christmas morning. Let's remove the plastic. So satisfying. We are going to slide the first covering and then we just need to hold the lid and it will slide right down. As soon as you open the box, you're welcome with get started instructions so you can learn how to operate everything the scale has to offer. It also has your guarantee card, so you can also register your Akaya product and it will be covered for two years. There are some nice, beautiful stickers included as well. Akaya has become a reference in the world of smart scales for coffee brewing. They have designed it so we can monitor the weight, time and flow rates as we brew with any kind of brewing method. Look at that beauty! In case you're wondering where to get one, there are links below. The scale also comes with some accessories. Uh, first, there's a heat resistant pad. There are some stickers you can put on the back of the scale. There are two types. One of them is non-slip and the other one is to prevent friction. You have to decide which one is best for your situation. It also comes with a charging cable. Uh, it's USB-C. Lastly, there is a calibration weight, which should weigh 100 grams. Okay, I just tried it for the first time and it didn't quite reach the right weight. And then I realized, oops, I actually didn't remove the plastic yet. So I went ahead and did that. <laughs> Everything is actually on the Get Started Guide, which I obviously didn't read first. So please be better than me and read your instructions first so you don't have to go through this. There you go. So one tap to turn it on, double tap to turn it off. Now let's set it up with the non-slip stickers. Remove any potential dust first and just do your best. To make it even. As you can see, my first try is, is not ideal, it's actually not looking good, so I'm gonna try again. Not perfect, but definitely better than before. And the second one, there you have it. Now it will not slip when I set it on a table, which is nice. Now let's remove the plastic from the display. And I think we're ready to do some quick testing. Something that's got me quite curious is whether or not it'll be able to weigh a smaller weight. I wanna try with a single coffee bean. Let's try with a lighter roasted coffee bean. All right, you see that? It actually worked. And it's completely impressive, the fact that you can measure a single coffee bean. I'm not gonna lie, I do have some concerns that we'll address later right out of the box things i love i love the packaging i find it gorgeous i think it's it's premium looking right you get this whole experience when you're getting it out of the box i love the way that it feels in my hand it's very sturdy has nice weight to it i just grabbed it and it turned on right away i was fully charged i actually love the fact that we have that charger here i have to see how long that battery will last now for my concerns long term, I am thinking about the color. I love it, it's aesthetically pleasing to me. I really feel comfortable with the decision I made, but at the same time, I'm brewing coffee here. Will it stain? The material, will it hold? There is a mobile app that I haven't tested. I just downloaded it. I will tell you more about it when we do our review. To find out if the Akaya Learner meets the expectations, 
I gotta start using it. So subscribe and turn on the notifications because I'll be dropping a full review and setup video pretty soon. And in the meantime, here's more coffee content for you to watch. I'll see you next time. I really wanna play with this.